Former Alaska Governor Sarah Palin's complaint that people are impersonating her on Twitter is getting some attention. It's raising awareness of the challenges of verifying microbloggers. Following her resignation as governor last week, Palin has been complaining of Twitter users impersonating her online. Now, Twitter allows users to post 140 character messages. The site says that it is hoping to test a feature that would allow it to verify posters. For her part, Palin has posted messages on her Twitter site warning web users that posts supposedly from her could be fake. And some of her messages apologize for previous fake posts. San Francisco-based Twitter has an estimated 17.6 million users in the U.S. during the month of May, several of which, by the way, anchors here at Bloomberg Television. Check them out.